Hey, welcome back to Jigs on Switch. We are back with Blue Red Delva going to our fourth match. Uh, we're currently on the draw against KG10, uh, going up against Reanimator, uh, and well, it's uh, <laughs> it's gone. Unfortunately, this hand probably isn't a keep. We don't have a threat, and we don't have a blue source. Um, we have ways to find them, but we currently don't have any ways to actually cast them. So. I think I'm pretty happy mulliganing this hand, seeing how we go. Sadly, just not where we want to be. The one land being a wasteland. <laughs> okay, we'll keep this. I'll bottom. Probably the two Volks, and then just have wasteland proof mana for a little while. All right. Island. All right. Young Pyromancer. Interesting. I'm not going to bolt here. I could bolt here and play around Spell Pierce. I could also fetch here and play around Wasteland. I think I'm okay taking out there. I'm just going to go for Mountain into Bolt here. Try to get off the field. This is fine. Brainstorm most likely means I have a fetch land, or um, it's going to be a pretty rough time for my opponent. Be interesting if they play fetch and pass, or fetch and then do something else. Maybe a ponder, maybe another delver. Seeing the basic makes me think this is going to be just blue-red delver. One thing about getting the mountain is that, the, is that we can't show that we're at least, maybe, showing days? Delva. I'm gonna Tarn Pass. If we can stifle our opponent, I think it, it definitely puts them back. Hopefully enough. Force pitch true name. They really want this red source. Maybe I want to force back and then just play Pyromancer in our turn. Being pretty aggressive here. <laughs> Maybe not the, the greatest, but I mean, if we could draw into days, that would be pretty nice. Delva. I'm going to go with Pyro. I think Pyro is the biggest payoff. It means the next turn we could even draw into a, uh, like a Bolt and still play the, the Delva. And just a miss on Red Mana. Interesting. So now is our real chance to draw an Instant or Sorcery. Delta. Let's go with Attack first. Play the Delva, and I'm going to keep the Polluted Delta in hand for now. I don't want to give away everything that we have. I want our opponent to think we might have something. To be fair, the reason to play the Delta is for Delver of Secrets. If it flips something that we don't want, like another land, we can fetch it away before we actually go to the draw step. So I'm going to say that that was the incorrect decision to keep the Polluted Delta.
All right. And that's the reason you, why you play Pluto Delta. Pretty fitting that it was just another copy of Pluto Delta. <laughs> Shouldn't six there as well because it gives my opponent the opportunity to wasteland my Pluto Delta. Uh, I should fetch before draw. I f should fetch. Okay. Let's just get a island. I think true name's my only good draw here. Ponder. Dread Horde is pretty good. I think Dread Horde is the play. Put on top, put on top. Put on top, draw Dread Horde. Play Delta first, so it can't be dazed. And now we get to fetch away those two fetches as well, which is nice. No four, no third bolt, please. No third bolt. Maybe a bounce effect. It's a pretty fast ponder. Okay. Do they shuffle? They chose to shuffle. Okay, that's good. Delve is pretty good. All right. I think it's still correct to lightning bolt the young pyromancer here. It just goes wide too fast. Interesting. It's 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 double we want to hit. So let's just quickly Unless that's that's how we do it. Yeah. All right. Um I don't want to throw it into Wasteland, let's just pass. Pretty good. Unfortunately, we just we just couldn't come back from the mall from five. We did have a few threats, we had a, a, a few ponders as well, but these young pyromancers are just, are just taking over the game too fast. To the board. I think I still just like these blue elemental blasts. Blading, blazing volley. Red elemental blast. Force out. Fluster storm in. Spell pierce out. Stifle isn't the greatest. Maybe stifle goes down and we actually just keep in one force. A braid's actually pretty nice. I like a braid. A braid's really nice because it does hit uh, Arcanist as well. 
I think this is okay. Days is an interesting one. I think I'm happy to take out Stifle as well because my opponents were at first game, so they might play around it. And even if they do, then we've kind of won that small battle there. Spellsnare is a card that I like. Spellsnare hasn't seen too much play recently, but I think it definitely should. Especially when Breach was around. A lot of really good two mana spells to Spellsnare. Charles for one, Young Pyromancer, Stoneforge Mystic, Thalia, Sylvan Library, Dark Confidant, Infernal Tutor. Alright, on the play, yes please. Hmm. This really relies on the Arcanist, and we don't have a way to protect it currently, which is pretty rough. The two fetches and brainstorm make this a little, little, little better. It's nice to have answers as well, just for a lot of their threats. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep this. Time pass. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I think we put back chain. And one Delva. Ah, I'm trying to wear and play around Stifle, eh? Haha. <laughs> Happy to try to protect this now. Sure. Sure. Cool. Lands are probably what I want here. I don't like sixing because of days, but I kind of just want to try to save as much time as possible here. I don't think I have the luxury of just waiting here to 
play around days with Arcanist. I think I just have to get a threat out. Even though it is my last threat, a little bit annoying, but... Bottom, bottom. Interesting. Oh, just an untap. Okay, now we're now we're going strong. What a pawn to do. Chose to shuffle. Oof. Still nothing. All right, now we really have to capitalize on this. True name. That's a pretty great way to capitalize. Sadly, young, young Pyromancer just didn't really have any gas behind it. I'm playing on the mountain because we do have one force left in the deck, so if we draw it, I want to be able to hard cast it. Pretty funny. So this is definitely where a Delver deck can just kind of misfire, especially with my opponent as well. Pretty funny to see, let's be honest. I like just hard cast days here. Red Elemental Blast mainly for true name. Okay, well, luckily I said that because we have Thread Elemental Blast. But they're up three cards. 
I'm still going to slam this. I could wait if I wanted to. Maybe it's correct to wait. I think I just need more time with the deck. Hmm. Don't really want to attack into this. I'm just going to pass. Hold up, Fluster Storm. No flip's kind of scary because it could just be like Dread Horde Arcanist, which is pretty good on this board. Free attack as well. Yeah, I'm not blocking. Interesting. If we had Brainstorm there, we could definitely create something. Hmm. Okay, now we need something like uh, the other copy of Blazing Volley. That'd be pretty good. A Braid. I guess a Braid starts something. Maybe I actually want to tap my jewels so I can represent colors at all times during my opponent's turn because they have this wasteland. Now the race is on. No flip, okay. No great attack either, which is really nice for us. Hmm. I think it's correct just to bounce this, just to get an extra token and start really apply, apply, up, applying some pressure. <laughs> I don't think it's worth Fluster Storming this, so I'm just going to let this resolve. That's fine. Get to attack for one, which is cool. There we go. Days. Interesting. Fetching that away. Good use of the fetch. Good use of the fetch. Also better basics than me, so that kind of sucks. <laughs> hmm. Arcanast is just the best here because it stops all my attacks. You can obviously use your graveyard really well, and I don't have anything to follow it up. So that's just a concession, unfortunately. Um, but good games. You know, I can definitely learn a lot from that match. I think I really need to just. Maybe dive a little bit more into the paper scene with my blue red control deck, blue red delver deck, apologies, um, and see how it goes because maybe I am just too aggressive with this deck sometimes, especially things like turn one delver, daze your ponder, where I might as well keep the land around, wasteland my fo the following turn, and then still have up days or flusters to almost spell PS. It's, it's pretty tough, but we're getting there. It's a learning curve. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying this. We'll see you for the fifth and final match after this.